So here we are in an ancient temperate rainforest, like many of those here in Cascadia. And you can see here that the forest floor is generally pretty difficult to navigate. It's really uneven with what is called pit and mound topography, which happens as bigger trees fall over and their root balls rip up, uh, big fallen logs that decompose slowly, and various bits of woody decay all over the place, as well as vernal ponds that form um, in depressions as things rot and grow. This is a sign that an ecosystem is really old and mature with lots of habitat for biodiversity and life continually growing on life all over the place. Contrasted here with the common second growth forest, the ground here is surprisingly clear and even, easy to walk through, you know? There isn't any pit or mound topography, there's often small woody debris from branches all over, and the biggest obstacles you're going to run into are remnant stumps of the forest ecosystem that existed here beforehand. Sure, these second growth forests are still forests by definition of an area covered by trees, and they sure are easy to walk through, but this lack of undulating topography means that there's less habitat for the flora and fauna that live here, less water absorption and runoff control, less nutrients in the ecosystem overall, which in the long term can lead to some really big problems.